Welcome to Yippie Kaye Namaste Yoga for Teens with Cheryl Crawford and high school students from around Metro Atlanta, some of them first time yoga practitioners. Yippie Kaye means joy, and we invite you to connect to that joy and to each other. Namaste means the goodness in me sees the goodness in you. So prepare for Yippie Kaye Namaste Yoga for Teens, where we connect our mind, body, and spirit as we laugh and move together. Hi and welcome to Yippie Kaye Namaste. Today we'll go from the state of trepidation to the state of trust. Often we doubt ourselves and doubt that anything that's gonna happen is worth happening. And we have this agitation and this fear around the, the future. So we'll move more toward the state of trust and we'll shake out some of our doubts and have a good look at them. Joining us today, we have Colette, Kaylin, Mateo, Kira and Mia. Really glad that you're here. Bring one hand to your heart, one hand to your belly. Close your eyes if you can. Tune in to you. And bring to mind if you have any doubts about the future, any agitation, any trepidation, worry. See what that feels like in your body. Where do the doubts hang out inside? To help us tune in, please listen to the sound. Take a full breath in to prepare. Exhale to get more settled. Place your hands together at your heart. Press your thumbs into your heart, your fingers straight up. Feel your palms together. Join us in the Adi Mantra, the Command Mantra, tuning us into our inner knowing, our inner teacher. Ong Namo Guru Dev Namo. Three times. Inhale to prepare. Ong Namo Guru Dev Namo. Hong Namo Guru Dev Namo Hong Namo Guru Dev Namo Full breath in Hold As you exhale, bow your head to your heart Take your time, come to your mat, ground your hands, your knees, your feet. Bring your sitting bones back, stretch your belly forward in the shape of a cow. As you exhale, pull your belly toward your back like a cat. Close your eyes if you can. Breathe in, sitting bones back, stretch your belly forward, lift your chin. Breathe out, pull your belly toward your back like a cat. Round your spine, let your head go. Three more like that. Breathe in, sitting bones back, stretch your belly forward, lift your chin. Exhale, pull your belly toward your back, round your spine. Good. Next breath in, get your sitting bones back and up even more, stretch your low belly, lift your chin. Exhale, pull your belly toward your back, completely empty your breath, squeeze. Last one, stretch your belly forward, lift your chin. And exhale, pull your belly toward your back. Inhale, come to table. As you exhale, root your hips back to your heels. Stretch your arms out in front. Bring your hands together, forehead down. Set an intention. Perhaps to be able to trust that any feeling or fear of agitation about something that may happen, you have the, the gym jams or the, the, the collie wobbles. <laughs> that it'll, you'll, you'll have the tools to get you more composure, more of that equanimity, so you have that trust in yourself and trust in what's to come. Trust in your strength and your power. Ground your hands down, lift your knees toward downward facing dog. 
Let's shake some of our doubts out to come to the surface. So lift one leg up behind you and shake it. Really shake. And lower the, that leg down. Lift your other leg up and shake it. Really shake. Lower your leg. Stretch one of your arms out in front of you and shake it. Like, hey, shake my hand. Shake my arm. <laughs> and the other arm. And shake it. <laughs> And lower down. Good. Now shake. Stay in your down dog for just a few more moments and shake everything. Like a dog does when they're really excited to see you. And they trust you so much. And they trust in your goodness. Because dogs know. Shake everything. Shake your head. Shake your belly. Shake your hips. Good. Walk your feet toward your hands. Squat down and come to sitting. All right. Bring your left thumb in toward your left nostril and bring your pointer finger, your middle finger right up at your forehead. Take your right hand, bring it right to your belly, close your eyes. Breathe in through your right nostril. And completely exhale. See how straight you can get your spine. And with your right hand right at your belly, bring your thumb and your index finger together. And keep locking your left nostril with your thumb. Breathe in. Long, deep, powerful breath. And exhale. And see how much you can focus on the flow of your breath. Eyes are closed and rolled up to where your fingers are and your forehead. Full breath in. Start your breath from the very bottom of your vessel and bring it all the way up. See how much you can stretch your breath and stretch your lungs. Keep your chin level. Hold at the top, and as you exhale, keep your chest level. Exhale all your breath out. Squeeze empty. Again, full breath in. Like you're pouring a glass of water, have your breath start at the very bottom and come all the way up. Filling all sides of your lungs. Hold. Completely exhale. Good. Fill up with breath. This gives us really clear mind and it's uh, our sun side, the energy side of ourselves, giving us energy to trust. Seeing the light of trust. Breathe out. And now breathe on your own. See if you can make your breath really long and deep. Count your breath in. Maybe you can go to seven or eight. Count your breath out. Try to pause a little bit in between. And when you stretch your breath and you get your breath long and deep, your lungs get stretched. So they have a capacity to, to hold long, deep, strong breaths. And with that, your heart gets stronger, your mind gets stronger, your emotions get stronger, and you have less trepidation and more trust. But here's the key. With everything that we do, there's always going to be doubt it's always going to come along. We have these doubts. We want to just make sure that we pay attention to them because they're really cute. And they'll be there with us all along. Often they like to hide behind our armpits inside or behind our knees. And just bring them out, shake them out, and pay attention to them. Lower your hand down. Bring it right on top of your other hand at your belly. Try to breathe through both nostrils. Okay, come sitting on your heels. And if it's hard for you to sit on your heels, have a blanket in between your heels and your sitting bones. This is Sat Kriya. This is a fabulous thing to do at any time you're concerned about the future or you have doubts about your ability to do something. What's tricky about it is our arms stay up. And <laughs> But what we like about it is we get to do a mantra while we're doing it. So in general, ladies, bring your left thumb, cross it over your right, and try to bring your thumb into this little mound right here between where your thumb and index finger are. And gentlemen, right thumb over left. Interlace your fingers, index fingers stretch together. And in a moment, you're going to bring your arms up like this. But before we do so, let's do the mantra. The mantra is Sat Nam. It means the truth of who I really am, not the clouds of doubt and worry that cover up, like the remnants of any time we doubted ourselves or worried. We have that dust, and it, it covers up 
the truth of who we really are. So when you say it, project sat from your belly like it's coming out, and nam, bring it out and up. Okay, and if, if it's really hard and painful to keep your arms up, if you have to bring them down, imagine that they're up. There's a lot of science to back that up. Okay, so cross your arms, interlace your fingers, index finger points, lift your arms up, try to go behind your ears, stretch your arms up, close your eyes, roll your eyes up to the space between your eyebrows, take a full breath in to prepare. Sat Nam. Sat. Nam, sat, 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 nam, Sat 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 nam. Sat nam, 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 sat, 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 nam, Sat 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 nam. Sat, nam, full breath in. Squeeze right below your pelvic floor and lift, belly in and up, chin back, hold, squeeze, stretch your arms, stretch a little bit more than your mind wants you to. Stretch your spine, stretch all the way up, roll your eyes, tongue, roof of your mouth, stretch, hold. Keep your arms up, completely exhale. Get empty and say and lock it in squeeze below your pelvic floor and lift belly in and up chin back squeeze squeeze tongue roof of your mouth roll your eyes squeeze stretch fingers all the way up and exhale sit cross-legged bring your thumb and index fingers together back of your palms down close your eyes see what that did feel the circulation throughout you Releases energy stored from our belly button down. All right, place your hands right at your shins. Keep your chin level. As you breathe in, bring your belly forward. As you breathe out, pull it back. As you breathe in, think to yourself, sat. As you breathe out, think nom. Keep going. Get rhythmic with it. Find your rhythm, move with that. Try to keep your chin level. Now 
And oftentimes when we're doing this, when we're having our internal mantra and we're moving, a lot of stuff can come up and try to distract us. So see if you can stay steady. Ground into your hands. This might be the little doubt sending irritants up, like into your scalp, at itches, or something like that. See if you can stay with it. Deep, full breaths. Keep your chin level. Move as much as you can. Feel your spine. As much as you can bring your spine in as you breathe in and bring your belly in as you breathe out. It's like cat-cow, but you're sitting. Use your hands on your shins to pull and help you. Keep your chin level. See how much you can tune into your spine, into your mantra, into your breath. You're doing really well. You're gonna come forward, take a full breath in. Breathe out, pull back. Come back to center, bring your thumbs and index finger together, close your eyes. And that helps with flexibility and releasing stuck energy that we can get when we're in the state of trepidation. Our energy just gets stuck. All right, this is the last thing we'll do that requires our lower body. So see, see if you can do 26 of these. Come into a squat, bring your hands in front of you, look ready and excited. Trust that you can do this. Bring your heels together and up, hands down. As you breathe in, straighten your legs, look at your knees. As you breathe out, try to keep your heels together and up. Squat down, look up, okay? I'll count, you go, ready? Inhale up, exhale down, one. Inhale up, exhale down, two. Keep going, inhale, exhale, three. You'll feel in the back of your legs. Inhale, exhale, four. Inhale, stretch up, exhale, five. Inhale, exhale, six. This really wakes us up, inhale, Exhale, seven. Inhale, exhale, eight. Inhale, exhale, nine. Four more and we'll take a break. Inhale, exhale, squat. Three more. Inhale, exhale, squat. Last two. Inhale, exhale, squat. Last one. And squat and come up and shake. Shake it out. So get all these doubts that we can do the second half. Get the doubts to the surface and know trust that we can do it. Why? Because it helps, it does so much for us. It's really good for our knees and our legs and our brain to do this. All right, you ready to do the second half? Yeah? Okay, squat down and 13 more. Ready? I'll count. Stretch up, exhale, lower. That's 14. Stretch up, exhale, lower. 15. Stretch up. Keep your hands down. Exhale, lower, 16 if you can. Stretch up. Exhale, lower, 17. Stretch up. Exhale, lower, 18. I'll do it with you in solidarity. Stretch up. Exhale, lower, look forward, 19. Stretch up. Exhale, squat, 20. Inhale. Exhale, squat, 21. Inhale. Exhale, squat, 22. Four more. You got it. Inhale. Exhale, squat down, 23. Inhale, squat down, 24. Two more. Inhale, squat down, 25. Last one. Inhale, stretch your legs, heels together. Lift and exhale, squat, lift your chin. Wow, you did it. Cross your legs. Sit. 
If you, ca if you can, sit on your heels, actually. And keep your spine straight. And bring your hands here. And as you breathe in, turn your head to your left. As you breathe out, turn your head to your right. And really try to breathe as steady as you can. Think sat as you breathe in and nam as you breathe out. Turn left and then right. Go. Ready? Inhale left, exhale right. Sat and nam. Sat, nam. Think it. Sat, nam. Or you can say it. Sat, nam. Sat, nam. nam. Say it or think it. Nam. Sat, nam. Sometimes it's hard to, to think it inside. We have to say it first in our own voice. And try to have it in your voice. The sat and the nam. See if you can make it louder than your thoughts. Let your thoughts still be there. It's kind of like you always have doubts, even when you have trust. Let your thoughts be there, but just make the volume smaller and make your inner mantra louder. If Sat Nam doesn't resonate with you, have victory, or another one that does, like trust and trust and trust and trust. But move your head. We're, um, if we were afraid to speak up, we had trepidation about speaking up. That energy gets stuck in our throat, and we want to clear that out. Hands on your thighs. Keep going. Sat, nom. Sat, nom. Really turn your head as much as you can. Our throat is the element of space. We want it really open. We feel more spacious, more trusting. We trust that we'll have the words that we need. We'll, we know that we have the right to speak and the right to be heard. We trust that others will listen and we find the words. And we'll meet the people that we're meant to connect with and create with. Come back to center. Sit cross-legged. Put your hands on your shoulders with your fingers in front, thumb behind, elbows out. As you breathe in, bend to your left. As you breathe out, bend to your right and keep going. This is really good for our spine. Inhale left, exhale right. It flexes the spine, it distributes energy over the whole body and it balances our field around us that protects us. So trust that you have a magnetic field. It's science and it protects us. So it protects us from negative forces when it's really strong. And this helps it get really strong. So your elbows might not touch down. That's okay. Do the best that you can. We often don't stretch like this. So that's what this, this style, this Kundalini practice that we're doing, it's, it's confronting. We stretch in all different ways. We hold our arms in angles that don't feel so great. And it helps cut into the subconscious where most of our stuff that we want to clear out because it's bogging us down. It's causing things like trepidation and it's feeding our doubts. We want to clear that out. Our doubts don't need to eat so much. Inhale left, exhale right. The final ones. See how powerful you can get your breath. The movement's half of it, the breath is half of it. Have your mantra, did you forget your mantra? Remember that. Okay, come back to center. Cross your legs, bring your arms out in front. Lift your belly, come all the way up to standing. And come onto your mat. So if you have a blanket, just move it to the side. As we decided to share with you a mantra to help. So it goes like this. It's a mantra with the mudra and a little shake. <laughs> I've got grit. So thumb and first finger. I've got grit. I've got wit. I've got clout. I shake doubts. I've got wit. I've got grit. I've got clout. I shake doubts. I've got grit. I've got wit. 
I've got clout, I shake doubt. So you can move around. I've got grit, I've got wit, I've got clout, I shake doubts. I got grit, I've got wit, I've got clout, I shake doubts. I've got wit, I've got wit, I've got clout, I shake doubts. I've got grit, I've got wit, I've got clout, I shake doubts. I've got grit, I've got wit, I've got clout, I shake doubts. I've got wit, I've got grit, I've got clout, I shake doubts. I've got grit, I've got wit, I've got clout, I shake doubts. I've got grit, I've got wit, I've got clout, I shake doubts. Last one, I've got grit, I've got wit, I've got clout, I shake doubts. And now for a few moments, just shake everything. Shake your head, shake your arms, shake your legs, shake your skin, shake your underarms, shake your chin, shake your back of your knees, shake your hair, shake everything. Ah. And bring your arms out in front, cross your legs, come to sitting, and lie down on your back, please. As comfortable as you wish. Your legs might be out straight. You might have your knees together, feet apart. Bring one hand heart, one hand belly. Tune in to you. And bring to mind that the sense of trust. Feel energy all around you, whatever color you wish, the light all around you. Feel composed, knowing that you're strong enough. And you trust your strength and your power. And feel the warmth and the light all around you. Rub your hands together, rub your feet together. Hug your knees into your chest. Rock on up to sitting. Bring your hands together at your heart. May the long time sun shine upon you. May all love surround you and the pure light within you guide your way on. Sat from your belly, nam from your forehead. Sat nam. Face the world in the state of trust. Yippee-ki-yay. Namaste.